Hey guys, welcome to the BD Themes widget tutorial. Today, we're going to introduce you to the animated link widget presented by Element Pack Pro. Web links have always been the same old, plain blue or red color text as far as we could remember. But with the animated link widget, the game changes. So let's drag and drop the widget in our Elementor page editor. By default, it should look like this unless configured. Let's first add some padding to get some space around the widget. Then change the font size from typography in order to have a bigger view. Now let's get back onto the content tab. Here, the style Matisse is selected as the animation effect of the link text. When you hover, an underline beneath the text appears slowly while both text and underline shine with color. This is the basic style. For your concern, we have added more than 12 animation effects to the animated link widget. Just click on the style option and select the one you like. For example, let's see the Iran style. It creates a bold underline under the link text that flattens out on hover, making it an unique animation effect. The he-like style is similar to the Adobe glitch effect but made for links in WordPress. Select the effect and hover over text to see how it goes. Then you got the Hertz style which is a semi half circle motion style under the texts. Next you have the locust style which makes a wavy underline beneath the link's text and moves up on hover. The IO style is made with two different underlines crossing each other from both directions. You can see it clearly here. The link style called Leda is another unique style that adds a span animation to both text and the underline but inverse to each other, something like this. We also have the Miname style that creates a moving underline going from the below to the top with bold animation. Ok then, let's change the button text for now. Below is a fill to insert your target link and at the bottom is the alignment option for the widget. Moving on to the style tab gives you color options, padding and typography to further customize the animated link. Let's change the text color first. This is for the normal mode. Then comes to the hover color. And a different option for the style color. Then we can customize the font further using typography. That's it, the animated link is ready for display. Thank you for watching this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Until next time.